This is the Winbridge M801 20 watt wireless voice amplifier. Let's take it out of the box. In the box you get the user manual. They give you an actual plug-in charger. That's a breath of fresh air. You don't see these too often these days with uh, devices. They just give you the cable. But of course you get that too. That's right here. And it's interesting because you can see it's USB to two USB-C connectors like that. And that is because it's a wireless microphone right there. So you can plug one into that, one into the actual unit, and charge them both up at the same time. Also included line-in cable, TRS plug at each end, 3.5 millimeter, your standard headphone jack kind of stuff. You could jack in anything that you want. If your phone still has a headphone jack or you want to use that, you can plug that in. Maybe you have an old boom box with a cassette player in it you want to plug in. You can do that as well. Over here is the strap. You can go around your waist, over your shoulder, anything like that. Let me tell you a bit more about the specifications of the unit, and then we'll go ahead and test it out. So let me just show you first around the unit, and I'll tell you the specifications about it later. You have a display over here that's going to show if you're playing music or something. We're going to get into all of this in a little bit. There are five buttons on the top. That's going to be your power on and your volume up and down, song forward, song back, recording, because it can record as well. The uh, loops here are for the strap that they give you. And on each side, there are two ports here. We'll start on this side here. This says TF USB DC. So opening that up, what we have here is a micro SD or otherwise known as TF card slot, a USB port, and a USB C port. So the USB C port, that's the charger. We got that one. And these two, you use one or the other. You can put a micro SD card in there or a USB flash drive. That's what I'm going to have with songs on it, MP3s, WMAs, that kind of stuff, and it can play that along with, of course, amplifying your voice. So that's that side. This side here says Mic Aux SOS. Now it's a wireless microphone, but that's not going to stop you from plugging in a wired microphone. Instead, the aux in, like I said before, if you have an old boom box with a cassette player, you can plug that in, something like that. An SOS I'm going to demonstrate a little later that puts out a siren type sound from the unit here. This has built-in Bluetooth 5.0 as well so you can connect a phone or a tablet up to it and play your music through there if you want instead. As I had stated before it can record directly to a plugged-in micro SD TF card or a USB flash drive as such. This is also waterproof, IPX6, so if it's raining out, something like that, it's not really going to be a problem for it. Uh, it does have a 30-minute auto shutoff, which is nice, because if you're not using it and you forget, it'll automatically turn off to save battery power. The microphone will uh, last for up to six hours, because it's wireless, on a charge, and recharges in only one hour. The main unit here is going to run for up to 15 hours and that will recharge in approximately three hours. On top of that you also have TWS mode. That is something I can't demonstrate because you need two of these and with that TWS stands for True Wireless Stereo where you can pair two Bluetooth speakers together to get a stereo image like that and at 20 watts that this is pushing out adding another speaker is another 20 watts and that'll give you a total of 40. So let's go ahead now and give this a test. So let's go ahead and turn it on. Press the button there for Bluetooth mode and now on my phone I'm going to go into the Bluetooth and we'll hit scan and if you take a look 
M801 right there. And there we are, we're connected. So now I can go back here and play some music. So that's all playing Bluetooth right from there. Uh, not much more to that, of course, it just works as such. So now what I'm going to do is put the unit on and let you see what it sounds like. We'll plug in a flash drive and try all that stuff out and go from there. So pairing is automatic. You just turn the microphone on. There is uh, There are four lights on here to show you the state of charge, 25, 50, 75, 100%. So we get the idea with that. There's a button on it and of course the USB-C port to charge. It's really not a big deal. Uh, you can go ahead and put that on. And we'll just adjust that. The microphone of course is on a gooseneck. And then we'll go ahead and power the unit on. And now as I speak you can hear that it amplifies my voice. Very simple like that. It does go pretty loud. This is only at half volume. As far as controlling the volume of the music as opposed to the volume of the microphone, the booklet didn't say anything about that. So you may wish to re-encode your MP3 files with that. Right now it's on pause and mute, which is why you don't hear me through it. If I hit the button again, then of course my voice goes through. And the music does as well. And you can see now that I have a different song on. You can just change songs on here just like you would on your phone or anything else. There's just buttons, you know, forward or back or like you would have on a Bluetooth speaker. And in fact, that will work if you're connected Bluetooth as well. But the recording function, you just press the R button for recording and it will record. I've already done that and I'm going to play back the recording I made. This is a test of the Winbridge M801 wireless voice amplifier. And you can change your songs like that. But you can see that the recording worked pretty well like that. I didn't speak, but I did before, and it worked well. Let's kill the music here. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this outside. And I'm going to crank the volume all the way so I can get further distance from the camera. And you see how you can hear me. Okay, in the backyard, and I have the unit on mute right now. So you're just hearing my regular voice. I'm going to go take a hike down to that white fence there. That's about 80 feet or so from where the camera is. So let me run down there for a minute. So now we'll take this out of mute. And now we're live again. And you can hear that my voice is certainly amplified. Let me crank it all the way. And here we are now at full volume, so you can see if you have a bunch of people you need to address, it'll be real easy. So all around, it works fantastic. Great sound quality through and through. You can record with it, play music at the same time. Remember, it's wireless, so you can take this off, set it off to the side if you're doing a stage performance or something like that. You can do that using this. And even though there's a plane going overhead, you can still clearly hear me over that with the voice amplifier. It goes really nice and loud. You heard it when I was at the fence back there. That really was quite good. So all around, it seems to work fantastic. This was the Winbridge M801 wireless voice amplifier.